In this video, we'll show how you can use the PDF viewer control to display PDF files on a UX component. So previously to display a PDF file uh, on a UX component, you had to display uh, a iframe and then set the iframe source to the um, PDF uh, file. But now you can display PDFs directly using the PDF viewer control. So you can see here we have a list control that is displaying the names of a bunch of PDF files and then as I tap on each row in the list we're displaying the PDF file in the PDF viewer control. So the PDF viewer control has it comes with a toolbar here so you can see you can open up the toolbar to navigate by page. You can close the toolbar down and you can also open up this menu here to display various uh, options such as the document properties or to search within the uh, PDF file, um, etc., or to rotate the PDF file, etc. So let's take a look now at how this was uh, built. So first of all, let's go back to the project properties here. We can see that inside this project, we've placed a whole bunch of PDF files. So these are files that are in the uh, web project folder so that they'll be published to the web root at the time this um, project is uh, published and then you can see we've gone over to our list control over here and we've got a static data source where we've uh, got the names of all of the PDF files and then uh, what we've done is we've gone to the um, toolbox here and we've selected the PDF uh, viewer control from the um, available controls. This is in other controls you'll see there. We've got the PDF viewer and we've configured the PDF viewer to basically have a height of six inches and a width of 60 of 50 percent. And we could also have set the initial PDF file to display uh, had we wanted to. So now let's go take a look at this list. And if we look at the list we can see that the list has an event in the on click event. So the on click event is going to basically get the value um, of the PDF file in the current row of the list. So that's going to be this dot selection data zero uh, dot PDF name. And I can get that uh, information by just going to more help over there. And then I basically call the PDF viewer load uh, method and I specify the name of the uh, PDF file to load. So that was, that's all that was necessary in order to display the um, PDF file that I'm pointing to over here in the uh, PDF viewer. So now I can go here and go to say 125% uh, and then look at this PDF in a little bit more detail. So the ability to display PDFs directly on a UX using the PDF viewer control is a nice enhancement that is easier to use than using uh, iframes um, to display PDF files. Thanks very much for watching.